you're in a precarious situation a lot of the times because there's a similar theme. We just talked about the George thing. We talked about the KSI. I mean, I've seen you on a situation where you're literally in between Jake and Logan, like, come on, guys. Yeah. You're like, hey, just sort of an innocent bystander here. Even with Tate, we know that Jake's, I'm um, sorry, Logan's had beef with, with Tate. But at the end of the day, you're on Team Logan. Like, you're not going to choose not on, anybody not, over yeah, Logan, No, right? no, fuck that, dude. Really? If, you, if, if he fucks up, and sorry for my, my cursing, if he, if he messes up, um, no, of course I'm You have following. that kind of relationship? 100%. Okay. 100%. If you, if you want to go back, listen, I've always had the, the, um, the like, kind of nickname of being this yes man, okay? If you go back and you see who has said no the most, there have been some opportunities that I've had that I didn't take because of legal ramifications, because of ongoing, you know, things that were going on that were happening behind the scenes where I couldn't do it, whatever. But but when he's off on a on a on a topic, me and him have had falling outs where we didn't talk for a month at a time because of things that I said about him on other really? people's podcasts that I didn't agree with stances that he had. No, I have no I that that's that's the thing that people make the mistake of. I owe a large chunk of my career to Logan. I owe a large chunk of my success to him. He's he's a, a, a good friend of mine. Um, but 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 we are not. Uh, I don't eat off his plate. You know what I'm saying? I guess in per, as it pertains to the podcast, we started the show together. We've we've done it all together. It was his star power that created the podcast. But I'm I'm a separate person. You know what I'm saying? Like he makes he makes mistakes and does things that that's that do not involve me whatsoever. There's no decision making anymore these days that he makes that has my blessing, my discouragement, so on and so forth. You know, so when all the stuff when when shit does hit the fan, which it inevitably will, when you are when you have the biggest target on your back out of anyone on the planet besides maybe Tate, but there's a couple other people, right? There's going to be a lot of, as I said, misinformation, assumptions, so on and so forth. All I can do is 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 just continue, you know being myself being authentic to who i am and then yeah no i've there's plenty of instances of me calling him out plenty of instances if you if people really wanted to research they can go back to those episodes where that christianity conversation happened the episode with bobby lee which was very controversial with george and you'll see me st either stand up for someone or stand against someone's opinion I, I by no means will ever fold to someone else based on anything you know, if it's if it's fake drama or, or wrestling stuff or, or fighting, then, yeah, I'm going to take his side 100 mm percent. -hmm. And even on the, the Jake and Logan, when they had the beef, when like Lo, uh, I think Jake wanted to bring uh, or, or the, the whole drink situation yep. with and Prime the and, the and the fight and everything yep. with that. Yep. You're kind of stuck in the middle here. Well, whose side did I kind yeah, of lean towards? Yeah, I think you were on Jake's side Correct. a little bit, right? Correct. So and it's like and I'm, I'm not I'm, I'm on the side of right. That's that's what I prefer to be on in life that is that is what i want to do i wasn't always like that talk about a segue that was not always my life i was not always on the side of right the side of empathy the side of caring about other people and how they feel and how their day is going to go after you leave an imprint on them that was not always me i was a piece of shit and now a lot and now a big chunk of my life is devoted to yo how can i how can i continue to to treat people well and stand up for injustices when I see them happening. It doesn't matter who the who's sitting next to me. I don't care who it is. Mike, what's what's the biggest difference between uh, uh, Logan and Jake? Because the, uh, what what a I mean, mom and dad should be sitting there saying like, did he, like is it is, is yeah. it the spirit of competition that they're so flipping competitive that they drive each other like because it's it's a difference between Tate's. Uh, dynamic when you see the two Compliment. versus very different, yeah, they right? Complement each other. Yeah, these guys look like absolute crazy, crazy psycho competitive. Is that a misread yeah, on no, how competitive no, they are? No, they are. They they both are. And I think and I think and I think the difference between them and the Tates is is Tristan. I think is is. You know, like his brother, a, a, a very powerful, driven, you know, you know, uh, opinionated person. But I think he 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 is comfortable playing a complimentary role to the big bad Andrew Tate, you know, character. And he's he's cool playing. He's cool being Pippin. I at least it seems like from the outside. I don't know if yeah. that's necessarily the case when you get close to them and have those behind the scenes that's conversations. How he is. These two yeah. were never yeah. going to be Jordan and Pippin. It's Jordan and Jordan or Jordan LeBron. They're not, they're, they're, 
they don't want it's not an it's not a I don't like you. They love each other. But but damn, it seems like sometimes watching it that competition can almost like start to haze over what what they really have, which is a brotherhood. I mean, they're mm-hmm. f- freaking brothers. But they are so the two guys are just so freaking driven, you know, to to succeed. But that's on the younger brother, because most younger brothers are gonna sit there and be like, "All right, that's my big bro." And you, by the way, you're spot on with Tristan. I think, I mean, even if you see old fight footage of of Andrew and and Tristan. Tristan was the corner man. He was the cut man, hyping right, him right, up. Right, like right. that's has been his role. And by the way, Tristan, absolute stud, gentlemen. We yeah, spent time with sure. them; they're amazing. But I think there was something in Jake that he's like, "Nah, I'm not." I'm not gonna be the Robin to your Batman. I'm gonna, go, I'm, I'm gonna be freaking Superman myself. Yeah. And like, there's something happening. They, I know they grew up humble, wrestling, Ohio. So there must be some major competitive fires going on. Comes from the it comes from from Greg, from the dad. You know, yeah. his, their their father is intensely competitive and and talk about conservative. You know, like real deal, like backwoods yeah. Ohio. Like you know, we'll kill. And, and he's we'll, super we'll, competitive. Oh, yeah. The father. Oh, yeah. And his does he poke? Does he drive or not really? Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, I yeah. mean, there you go. Then that's... Oh, he, uh, but I, oh, he pushes I, those. I think it's worked for them. Meaning, whatever Tristan and Andrew Tate are doing has worked for them. Yeah. Especially, especially now they're in jail. It's like teamwork, <laughs> brotherhood. Not, are they in jail right now? No. When they were... Yeah, 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 yeah. With what they're going through now. When they were just in jail. We yeah, I think, that. I think if you... But put, these guys... What made them great, in my opinion, yeah, but, is they were both not no, settling for but, number but two. But I tell you, but I tell you, that, but, but that's exactly what it is. Because, you know, uh, uh, the, f- uh, the person that controls the two boys being united or competitive is the father. Yeah. It, both things, what you have in common is a very strong father personality, right? Yeah. Based on what you're talking about. And Emran and Greg, right? Now, yes, the best podcast would have been the two fathers, right? But I think... <sighs> His father passed away October 16, 2015. Can you can you check to see Emery Tate, when I mean, Emery Tate? When did yeah. he die? Are you I, big with stats like that? Do you I'm like big to, with dates? Oh, what yeah, day yeah, did he yeah. die? Let's see what day. October 15, 2017. October 17. I'm sorry, October 15, 17, 2015. Yeah. I was one day off. So, so when you when you when you think about fathers, he, here's what you'll notice, Adam. Okay, father on one side says, if you guys even fight each other, I'm the one that's going to come and do this. The other one is poking against right they're both effective but you know one is going to lead to this and the other one's going to lead to boom 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 regardless you're going to know both of them you know but even deep down inside that only works if the boys have the psycho competitive dna wiring in them yeah and i think all four of them got it you know tristan if you're around tristan it's a very very Tristan's a very interesting guy. He floats. He doesn't even touch though. He just, he just. <laughs> oh, does he? Like, uh, is he actually able to levitate? He's such a chill, bro. He's so nah, chill. And, 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 so a big, chill. and a big testament to we were talking about brothers yeah. and the loyalty, bro. When they came to get Andrew, Tristan wasn't arrested. He just was like, wherever my brother's going, I'm going with him. Yeah. Yeah. Like literally, was just like, I'm. They're like, no, you're not the rest. They're like, no, no, I'm going wherever my brother goes. And that's like the testament of. So, just, what are you saying that that Jake would just let Logan get arrested and he'd stay home? I don't, I don't know about I, that. But no, you, I don't I think, think Jake mo- would do that. I feel like most. No, no, I, no, no, I, I don't think, think Jake would do that. Jake's not let going to Jake. That's what I'm saying. No, like, he's, not going like, he's not going. What do you mean? No, well, let me. Ask, you guys got siblings? Yeah, yes, I have a brother. Course, yeah. You guys I, going to jail with him? I would. No, my brother. No, dude. If you go to jail, in, with in that, the answer that, is no. In that situation, if we're in a different country, and me and my brother are about to go into a freaking gulag, I'm going with my brother. Well, no. yeah, my brother yeah, knows that. Yeah, if you're going into a Spartan fight, well, no, no, and no, you no, have no. this, one of you has no, to no, come I'm out. Sorry. One of you needs to stay out and get bail money, bro. <laughs> no, no. If me and my brother were in, in Tristan and Andrew's yeah. situation, and they're about to take me into some fu- that it isn't America. We're in a different country. I'm 100 percent going with my brother. Hands down. Yeah, see, so that's the, that's Hands different. Yeah, down. I guess if you're in a place where like they're in Romania, bro, yeah, and yeah. the judge doesn't speak English, and the the guards, I, no, I'm Mike. Might, if I'm you get arrested, God forbid, in Miami, just call me. I'm not going to jail with yeah. you. I'll bail you out, okay. bro. Well, I I'll think, I, I think I should, <laughs> I'm going to call him instead, bro. <laughs> we'll go with you. He's coming. We'll go I'm with you. Oh, by the way, let me. I, ask, I, I don't <laughs> think I don't think Jake would let anything happen to Logan. I agree, hundred percent. I don't think Jake would let anything happen to Logan, and I think Logan, uh. uh as an older brother, sometimes you'll test to see how much your brother can take, and I think he would jump in as well. But Andrew and, and Tristan, they're gangsters. I love it. It's them. a very different mindset. Mm-hmm. Okay, the mindset of a gangster is 
No one is going to come in between us. Anybody that's, again, like I remember we had it in the, and this is why we get along very easily. Like yeah. it was a natural connection we had. We're in the army. It's me and my friend Jeff, white guy from Victorville, California. And we had a couple other guys. We had McElroy, and it was mainly the three of us, right? We had a couple other guys, but it was mainly the three of us. If you even said one thing, <laughs> listen, me and Jeff are at lunch, chow hall. We have a fight going on, him and I. We're full on fighting. We go afterwards to the gym where racquetball is being played. Two black girls are playing racquetball. We said, do you mind if we come in here real quick? <laughs> Unless you guys want to play with us? We said, absolutely. We're be no, I'm not even, I'm, I he, believe it. if he's listening to this, he will oh, remind the story. What? We, I swear to God, he <laughs> will tell you this. Oh, who's but, you so, went into God. the racquetball. To we went into him? the racquetball. We asked the girls to get out for 20 minutes. Beat the sh- <laughs> I swear to I God. Believe it. We, what are okay. you saying? Okay. So Bradford's been Bradford was so we get into oh, 18 years old. Bradford? Bradford, yeah. Whiskey Bradford? Yes. So we oh get into God. a full on fight, right? Guess what happens? We're both bleeding. <laughs> we went to the gym, we worked out, our friends came, and they're making fun of us. And then we fought them <laughs> because we can do this to each other. You can't talk to us like this. Yeah. Who do you think you are? You're not in the circle. Yeah. Don't even think about like, yeah. but that's the mindset of a gangster. Yeah. Gangsters are wired in a different way. The, the gangster model is it happens in business. Like Trump is a gangster. It is certain basketball, like Michael Jordan was a gangster, right? Pat Riley is a gangster. It is a different mindset. You don't have to be politically on the same side. It's simply a way of thinking that if you, God forbid, are no longer loyal to me, if somebody screws you over, dude, we're rolling together. That's how we're rolling. It's yeah, not that's, for, yeah. that's not you don't you don't see that very often in in nowadays. It's it, that's that's a I don't concern, disagree. That's yeah. a traditional thought process. Like I think back to my old lifestyle that is in the fifth vital, which you know you read, and and I think back to a time where. Dude, one cross word about you, you defended yourself half as hard as you defended your friends. If right, somebody yeah. you people can come up to you and say a bunch of shit and you're just no, nah, nah, I'm not I don't want to catch another felony tonight. But one wrong word about your your boy who might be a little bit smaller, bro, you're you're it's it's we're, we'll all die here. We could all <laughs> fucking die here. I don't care. You know what I'm saying? Like that that. That mentality exists. I always think of the movie The Town, which is one of my I favorite movies. I love it. God, Sick. Ben. Affleck. I know exactly Sick. what scene you're yeah, about yeah. to talk about. Yeah, yeah. He goes about. in like I, I, I yeah. can't, I can't tell you, I can't tell you what, what we're doing. I can't tell where we're going, but we're gonna hurt some we're people. Hurt you can never bring, you can never ask me about it again. And he, he doesn't hesitate. He goes, "Whose, Whose car, car are we taking?" <laughs> Just instantaneous. Such bro. a great oh, scene. Because You've seen it on Instagram a million, a million times, times, right? Because yeah. when you think about it. A lot of times it comes down to what are the circumstances that you're up against as a, as a team. Of, of course, Logan and Jake from their respective 20 and 25 million dollar mansions behind the gates of a, you know, a gated community in Puerto Rico might look at the, the, the circumstances that they're up against differently than the Tate brothers who are, who are facing a, you know, other jailmates in a Romanian prison, right? Or, or you know, or or what you were up against when you were in the army. I think, I think conditions in a lot of ways dictate how you act as a human in this world. No, you know? I don't. I don't disagree. So, so if you like this clip and you want to watch another one, click right here. And if you want to watch the entire podcast, click right here.